Hello and welcome to another Redstone tutorial. So in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing a water cooler. So this is a water cooler and uh, basically it's just going to fill up water buckets. Think of this like as a more fancier infinite water source. Um, so let's just go and demonstrate. So we throw in our water bucket and then we get it shot out as a full water bucket. So you can do it again and it will dispense out a water bucket so this automatically fills up fills up the bucket with a wa with water and dispenses it back out now you can't mass spam this um uh, you can't mass spam this it will it won't break it but the buckets will just get stuck in the uh in the uh, droppers and then they'll just be stuck like that so you can see we're getting buckets of water filled up so and there we go does it pretty fast it also does you can also do it the opposite way you can put in water buckets and get empty water buckets which i think is kind of cool but doesn't really make sense so you can throw in water buckets to get empty ones so it's a pretty cool uh, i think it's pretty cool it's just a really fancy uh infinite water source if you want to or it can work as an actual water cooler um you know just dispensing water buckets of water. So yeah, I'll get into the uh, build right now. Alright, so for this build, we are going to be needing a 6x3 uh, block area. So you're going to need 3 blocks and 6 blocks this way. And you will need to be 5 blocks down. So uh, this grass block represents a uh, ground level. And uh, this shows right here. Uh, the flooring, and you'll need to go five, the five blocks down. So one, two, three, four, five. So you need down here. Now these blocks right here, the diamond block represents where you'll be throwing in your water bucket. So the water bucket will go in here, and the gold represents this chicken. The gold represents where uh, the bucket will be dispensed out of. So uh, just keep that in mind for what kind of placement you want. So uh, this is where you'll throw water buckets. And this is where uh, they'll come out of. So, as always, well, as always, but I will have a resource list right here so you can build this in survival. Uh, I try to make this as efficient as possible so you don't need to make too many expensive, um, doesn't require too many expensive things, but yeah, so you'll need three rust and dust, two repeaters, one comparator, three rust and torches, uh, three observers, two hoppers. Uh, two droppers two dispensers and an infinite water source or just two buckets so we only need two buckets a my cut with hopper well we'll add this for last um so you can finalize build and blocks to build with because you will be needing um blocks to place down redstone and build the redstone obviously so uh, yeah all right so starting off first we're going to come down to where our placement is or well our uh, um, items will be dispensed and all we need to do uh, for here so far is to come here build up three so from here uh, you just build up three and place a hopper just a normal hopper so it'll funnel down as that and now coming from here we come over here on this side and place our dispenser so what will happen here is our micro with hopper will be up here uh, it'll be on side of block so you won't be able to see it but then it'll get funneled into the hopper and then into the dispenser and this will be where our water source gets filled in so now from here we're gonna go ahead and actually build the water source now so you just need to come here like this make something of like a uh, um, uh something like a smile basically like this break this and break this and this is where we'll put our water and let's actually quickly grab our water <laughs> so we need that right here so place one here and one here and that will be the infinite water source so now we have our infinite water source and we can go ahead and continue on with our building all right so now coming from here we're gonna want to go ahead and come down to our gold block <clears throat> sorry our gold block and go ahead and build up two bring this and you come around here with another hopper so coming from this spencer into this hopper place it in and there we go so this is where our items uh our buckets will funnel from so they'll funnel from the spencer into the hopper and from here 
we're gonna need to place our um our dispensing mechanism which is gonna need two droppers so we're just gonna crouch and place one dropper two dropper and then coming from here we will need a dispenser so i'll explain why we need one in a minute so dispenser so it should go dropper dropper dispenser and it should be right next to this hopper like this as well so that will be the dispensing mechanism all right now coming from this dispenser or this side of the dispenser from this block i'm gonna go ahead and build up two like that so coming from here we're gonna place down a rest on comparator this comparator will detect when there's a, an item in this dispenser here in case is our bucket so we're gonna come up here like this place a block down here place one more block like this and i'm gonna quickly we need this block so i'm gonna break it so uh, this will indicate where our rest will be placed in a block like this then now we're gonna come here we're gonna place one redstone dust one repeater put on four takes so all the way so it gets a delay and we come around here on this block and place a redstone torch like this so this will ensure that when an item comes here uh after a, a four take delay it'll unlock the hopper allowing it to funnel into here now coming from this redstone we're going to place one block like this place a block above it and then one coming like this we can break this now from this side we're going to place one more redstone dust and one more repeater just one tick so don't change it like this all right so now coming down from <clears throat> coming down from this hopper we're going to go ahead and place it up you should crouch and place an observer so this observer will detect when an item uh funnels into the hopper so oops placed a observer in the wrong spot i don't even know how i did that Let me, there you go so one like here make sure it's facing its face is facing the hopper and then from here we place one block here and then we place one block here and actually hold on we need to fill in these two place observers so build up like two blocks like this and come to this side and place two observers so one like this and one like not like that there we go one like this so their faces should be facing out this way and then when they get uh an update they will dispense out our items now from this observer right here we place our redstone torch we place one piece of redstone it will get activated and we place one more redstone torch right up here it'll get deactivated and that's basically it this is the whole wiring mechanism so i'll go into the demonstration right now all right now so i've quickly set up the flooring so this will be the flooring and this is where our hopper is so i'm gonna now put in our um minecart with hopper so you just go ahead place down your minecart place down a railing and you come down here and you simply just break it so uh we should go down here and you should be able to see the hitbox and break there we go now we can put in our uh pistons so they push in the block so like this there we go and boom so now let me break this so now there we go oh yeah uh by the way make sure there is a block uh covering this dispenser because if not it will just dispense out the bucket as uh, the actual water and then it'll spill all over the redstone and whatever else you have and ruin it so make sure there's a block here so that way it dispenses out as a bucket and uh, not water so now you can come here with some empty buckets and throw one down and then oop well it fell but there we go water so yeah actually let me add back here there we go so let's try it again throw one here and water so there we go the reason why we have a dispenser instead of dropper because uh if it was a dropper the item would go back into the microwave hopper it's a weird it's a weird glitch but it will go back into the uh, the, the minecart with the hopper and then it'll go back into a loop and it'll just make an infinite loop for some reason but uh yeah there we go that's how you make it so and again you can do the reverse as well you can just throw in one and it will shoot out an empty water bucket so yep 
anyways guys uh, i hope you enjoyed uh me building this build i i had some fun building it because uh, i just really like redstone but yeah you know anyways uh i'll see you later bye